everyone. I'm back with robot letters this time. So these ones are special because you need a long line at the very start and then you need to go around. So all of these go down, back up and give an arm. Go down, back up and round. Down, back up, just like that. So this is why they're called robot letters because you give go down the robot and then you need to make the rest of the letter. So let's start with our er, our R sound. So we're going to go down the robot's body and give him an arm, just like that. Down the robot's body and give him an arm. One more, down the robot's body and give him an arm. Beautiful. So we've done it three times to make sure that they look similar. And I think they look similar. I bet you can do it even more beautiful than I can. So our next one is our B, our B. So we're going to go down the boot to the heel and round the toes. We're going to go down the boot to the heels and round the toes. Down the boot to the heel and round to the toes. I've done it again three times so it looks lovely. And that's our B sound for b -b ball. Okay, our next letter is our N, our N. So again, we're going to go down with our nice long line. I'm going to go back up and down like this. So down knobby over his net, just like that. Down knobby and over his net. Now, you notice I'm not taking my pen off at all when I do this. So don't take your pen off. Okay, our next one. Now, our N and our H, our N and H, look similar, but the only difference is that our H has a taller bit. So make sure when you do your H, your H, that it is lovely and tall, just like a horse. So we're going to go down the horse's neck over his body just like that now i need to be careful that i don't do this because that looks like an n it looks like our mm sound so i have to be very careful that i don't do that okay so down the horse's body up and down down the horse up over his back just like that okay so our next sound is our mm, our M sound. So we're going to go down Maisie over the mountains, just like that. Down Maisie and over the mountains, just like that. And I'll do it one more time. Down Maisie and over the mountains. Lovely. Now, this one can be a bit tricky. This is our k, k, k sound. This is our K. This is our kicking K, not our curly K. Okay? So, what you're going to do is you're going to obviously take your time because your handwriting will be beautiful if you take your time. What we're going to do is we're going to go down the robot, up. I remember I'm not going to take my pen off. Round, back in, and flick. Like that. So we're going to go down, back up, round, and flick, just like that. We go down, back up, round, flick, just like that. Now, I think that is quite consistent because I've done it three times. It's quite good. I'm quite happy with it. I bet that yours will look beautiful. So you'll have to all show me your beautiful handwriting afterwards. Okay. So our next one is our, our P. So we're going to go down the pirate's plait, up to the top and round his face. And remember, we don't want any floating letters, do we? So we don't want our P up there. What's it doing up there? So it needs to sit on the line. So let's make sure it sits on the line. So we're going to go down the pirate's plait, back up, round his face. Remember not to take your pen off either. So down the pirate's plait, 
up and round his face. There we go, beautiful. So I've done all my robot letters. And now your challenge is to write a word which has a, as many robot letters in as you can. Now it can't be a nonsense word, so it can't be urban mission. That's not a word, is it? So we need to think of some words that have as many in as we can. Now I'm looking at them and I can think of one that is run. So we need our vowel, we need our uh sound. So we've got er, uh, mm, er, uh, mm, run. So we've got our er and our mm. So I'm gonna write it here. So for the er, we know it's down the robot's body and give him an arm. Our uh, uh is our ladder letter. So we're going down the umbrella, up to the umbrella, into the puddle. And our mm, our mm sound. So down Nobby over his neck. Just like that, we've got er, uh, mm, run. And we've used two robot letters. So if you can think of any other words, you might use bin or mum. Mum might be a good one. That would be really, really good. So I hope you join me for next time, which is our last ones, which is our zigzag monster letters. So I hope you join me for them and I'll see you all soon. Bye.